So I thought I'd show a little trick with getting water-based paints like acrylic out of a palette. Uh, you can see it's pretty gunked up in some areas. Now the, the trick isn't going to fully get everything out, but it usually gets a good bit. And that's just filling it with water and putting it in the freezer. Uh, what happens is, is the water freezes, the paint bonds with it, and it sticks to the ice. So I'm just going to fill these up and doing it one-handed right now. So usually you don't want to go over each well area, um, but I'm kind of making a mess right now with the water. <laughs> So, very carefully, I'm going to walk this over to the freezer. Do, do, do. There's stuff in the freezer. And just somewhere where it's going to be kind of level. won't just spill everywhere so we'll get that in there and then we'll come back and check on it after uh, give a little time to freeze so I just watched a few TV shows while letting it freeze so it might have been a couple hours um, maybe an hour and a half wasn't really keeping time but you know if you have an ice tray you know how long it takes normally but as you can see the paint is stuck to the ice like I said it doesn't get everything but it usually gets a good bit of it um, depending how flexible your palette is determines how easy it is to pop out I'm working with one hand I need needed to actually set the camera down real quick And sometimes you just gotta knock it around or give it a good bang. But again, you can see all the paint that uh, sticks to it. So, again, not everything, but it gets a good bet. And Now, ideally, I should have done this like over a, a little shopping bag or right into the trash can, but I wanted to actually show you how much it all gets, so I just banged it over the sink and cleaned it out later. But some some of them it got a little bit of paint. Some some of the um, areas it got almost all the paint out. And it's just kind of neat to have cubes of uh, paint <laughs> with multicolors. So, it's a neat little thing. This, uh, this one area was in really thick and actually the well, re really strong um, thick paint. And the harder it is to get out, the better the bond will be. So it's actually a good thing, because that, that one was pretty much full of old paint, a few different greens. Again, sorry for the one-handed camera work there. So there's uh, all the different paint cubes. So you can just see how it just bonded and through through 
multiple layers of paint. So I don't know if this really saves time from sitting there and scraping paint out of a palette, but I, I think it's neater at the very least. And you get to make a mess while cleaning a mess. <laughs> And finally got out the last stubborn piece. And like I said, the hard the harder it is to get out, the better the bond. That almost completely cleaned that section there. Um, so a big square O paint. So yeah, um, try it out. Work with should work with. This was acrylic, so it should also work with watercolors. Um, anything water-based. Again, didn't get everything, but got a good bit. All right, thank you for watching.